It's the second week of January 2008. I'm Todd Paddington, and this is Showbiz Newsy News. The Golden Globes are canceled this week due to the writer's strike. Amongst the people most upset are my mom and my gay brother, Charlie. They canceled them? Oh, hell no. No! It's okay, Charlie. The Ghost Whisperer Season 1 just came out on DVD. It did? Yay! Charlie, ladies and gentlemen. Tom, call security. This just in, Miley Cyrus, a.k.a. Hannah Montana, has admitted using a body double during her concerts. Wait a minute, people are upset over this? I say too scantily clad 15-year-olds are better than one. <laughs> Am I right, Tom? Am I right? Um, no, Ty. It's called being a pedophile. Really? 15? Too young? Yes, Ty. How about uh, 16? Still too young, Ty. Oh, really, Tom? Oh, really? Well, I guess getting a woody off a 16-year-old Jamie Lynn Spears is wrong, too, right, Tom? She's pregnant, Tom. Pregnant! What is she, the Virgin Zoe? She had sex, Tom. That makes it okay. It's true. I looked it up. Um, that's not true, Ty. Really? Uh, really, Ty. Are you sure, Tom? Uh, yes, Ty. Damn. Tell my assistant to cancel my Zoe 101 season pass. Now I just feel dirty. (laughs) Mishka Barton has apologized for drinking and driving and smoking the doobie. She told Ryan Seacrest that she's, quote, not perfect and very disappointed in herself. She promises that next time she'll make a run for it and possibly pop a cap in those dirty pig's ass. Maybe Mishka needs to be more like Britney Spears. Last weekend, Britney Spears was taken to the hospital after refusing to give up her kids to her ex-husband and acting like a crazy person. Britney came up negative for narcotics, which means she's just a total loon. Here are some things Britney did in her 24-hour hospital visit. At the hospital, Brittany kept calling the doctor Willy Wonka and kept trying to eat the pillow, calling it the biggest marshmallow ever. Brittany demanded more lollipops, saying every time she sucks one, she creates a boner. She then danced around, calling herself the Boner Fairy. And finally, Brittany kept claiming she was actually from the future and that the secret technology of future races were housed in her vajayjay. Just before Brittany was released from the hospital, she was paid a visit by Dr. Phil. The TV doc assured Britney that Bald was in fact beautiful and told her that Oprah was in fact God. He then demanded to see her vajayjay. And now it's time for this week in pictures! Wow, I hate to be the one to say this, but Christina Aguilera has really let herself go! Okay, you gotta take it in your hands like this and massage it gently, never letting go and then swirl it around, and then give it a tug or two. After that, he'll never leave you. <laughs> what? Oh, I'm sorry, how's this? Can you see my tits now? <laughs> okay, listen up, Daddy Warbucks. Get away from me, bald dudes are creepy. I'm serious. And finally, by popular request, the long overdue, get ready for it, say it with me. Cock goes here! <laughs> that was Shubba's Newsy News. I'm Ted Paddington, and I am the father of Jamie Lynn's baby. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>